What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Moto WordPress Names and in today's video we're gonna learn how to buy or purchase a domain name into the Google Domains platform of domain registration. The very first step is go to your google.com and search for Google Domains. After this you can click into the very first option And if you already have a Google account with no need to login, you're going to be direct to the dashboard. But normally you go to this homepage, find your place online, choose from more than 300 domain endings. In my case, I'm going to be searching for a domain for my wife. The name is right here, segurosorocaba.com. As you can review, we have a lot of endings and terminations and related names. The prices are displayed in my current location currency, so reais or RS. And if you go to all endings, you can see more. And if you scroll down, you can see more about it. You can see some insights related to the domain. For example, the name has a popular ending, the .com. The name is easy to pronounce and type when heard. And the words from the name are spelled correctly. You can click into Add to Cart, into this nice icon from the cart, and go to this page. Please send the auto renew so you do not lose your domain. You can also purchase a Google business for a custom email and other Google nice tools in the case that you want. In my case, I will not select this thing. Also, make sure that you set the privacy protection on because this is going to protect your domain to see your personal information when searching for domains. I'm going to leave a link in the description below and a card over here for a video tutorial where I will explain how to find the domain owner. Here's the information. You can purchase a year or you can purchase more times, more time, for example, two, three, four, or even 10 years. For more time, you need to contact the Google support. Review all the information. There is no discount in the case that you want to purchase the domain name for more time. However, if you do that, Google will understand that you are not planning to sell or to do other things with your domain. And this can potentially help on your search engine options. Now you need to complete your billing information to register the domain. You need to type your address, your name, your information, your date of birth. And in the end, you're going to need to apply your credit card information. If you already have a Google account and Google purchased Google products, for example, YouTube Premium or other kind of products, you will probably already have the card saved on it. It's a quite extensive form, but take two or three minutes to complete. I recommend that you complete this part very carefully because this is your domain and this is really important and in the case that you need to change it, you need to contact Google support and gonna be a little hard. So take your time to complete every single part of this form with no need to worry. Also while searching your domain name, try to review the logo options for the domain, the location, the type of business, I'm gonna apply into the description below a tutorial where I do explain how to purchase a domain name and the points that you need to consider. I recommend that you take a moment to review the it's a blog post present on visualmuro.com website. Now it's the payment option, review purchase. I'm gonna be purchasing two years of this domain. 
and registering the seguro sorocaba.com Google gonna check the credit card information and we already have the domain purchased. Now we can take other steps to make the website online. You can point the domain the the domain name to the DNS of your host so we can apply the domain to the host to make it online. But this are gonna be exploring in another video. By now I recommend you explore this Google dashboard options, for example. Right here, we can get the Google Words Place. We can review the DNS into the left side of options. We can check the security. By default, into the security, the domain can be transferred and you need to set an option onto this panel in the case that you want to transfer the domain for another registrator, naming registrator. If you go to your email, you can see that Google Domains will send you information about your purchase, like the invoice, and you're gonna need to do an action, an action required email. You need to confirm, you need to verify your email now. This is the email used to purchase the email, the domain name. The domain, the email is already verified, and we can go back to the Google Domains dashboard to explore extra option after reviewing this welcome email. Google gonna guide you and send you information about what you need to do after this, but you now have your domain purchased in one of the most safe places to have your domain purchased, the owner of the internet. And it is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And don't forget to check out the visualmodel.com portfolio of amazing WordPress themes. And I see you later. All the best!